Hey everybody and welcome to Coach Max Game Corner. Today we're opening up the first of a good little haul of uh, Christmas presents. Today we're looking at two of these tins. Uh, my wife ordered them from GameStop. They were half off? 30% off or so, and uh, I didn't know she was ordering two of them, and she's just the best, and so here we go. We have the Zacian V-10, and Zamazenta V-10. So we get both promos. Now there's five cards in each of these, so let's just dig on into these. Now normally I'm not a big fan of tins because they don't hold cards the best possible way, but they're still really nice. Uh, they, they look really nice on the shelf. There's, there's one of the boxes. I'm gonna go ahead and open both boxes all at once as, as I drop that one everywhere. And then we'll open up all the cards in one go. So here's the Zamazenta box. It's got a Zamazenta right here. The promo card is right there. It looks like Rebel Clash is on the top of that. Here is, I just dropped everything. Here's that Zamazenta V card. Looks really, really nice. And a five packs in this. It looks like it does come with an evolution, so that increases the value of this box immediately. Three, two Rebel Clash, which is a uh, set that I have not started collecting yet. I have a few. Sword and Shield, the set that I have started collecting. Burning Shadows, uh, don't care. And Evolution, so we'll put that one aside. And that's everything else in the box. So I'm gonna assume the second box will be exactly the same. I would assume so anyways. Open this one up, we have, you can see, Zacian V, that card right there. Give you a, give a closer look to it. Boom, Zacian V promo, looks really, really nice. And I would assume the exact same, two Rebel Clash, one Sword and Shield, one Burning Shadows, and one Evolution. So we have a good, good little bit of stuff to open in this. We're gonna save the Evolution cards for the end, obviously. So we're just gonna put, uh, put those over here. I say we start with Burning Shadows, then we'll move on to the Rebel Clash, then Sword and Shield, then we'll finish up with Evolutions. So, here is Burning Shadows. I don't know what is of any value in this set. So this one is just gonna be a nice, nice little set to open up. Just cause, uh, you know, no matter, the, no matter the set, it's nice to open Pokemon cards. One, two, three, four. And we're starting off with a fire energy in this pack. Charmeleon, that's a cool looking Charmeleon. What would Pokemon be without the Charizard line? Whirlipede, Wabufet. I don't know why I said it that way. Horsey with a really cute horsey artwork. Cutie Fly, Ledibaugh. I like that Ledibaugh artwork. Alolan Grimer, Riolu, Porygon Z Reverse Hollow, and that's a rare. So that's really nice to get. And Toxicroak non hollow is our rare in that pack. I do know Burning Shadows has had, um, like at Walmart, at our Walmart anyways, you can get it in an Elite Trainer box for $30. Uh, so I think, I don't think there's many great cards to chase after in this set. That's why they're $30, because they've ordered a ton of them and no one's buying them. Anyways, well, we started with our Vile Plume because I did too many on the cards, I guess. Well, cool. We got a rare Hollow Vile Plume in this, in this pack. We have a Fairy Energy. Bodybuilding Dumbbells, because I'm a Dumbbell. Semipoor. Soul Rock. Charmander. Porygon. Really cool looking Porygon artwork. Meryl, oh, it's the Wooly World artwork. I love that. Hoot Hoot, Rhyhorn, that, this Hoot Hoot feels very thick. Not the Hoot Hoot itself, but the card. You know, I don't wanna, ooh, let's not go there. Rhyhorn, and the Reverse Hollow is a magic card. So, because I am inept at opening packs the proper way, we got a, uh, a different kind of sneak preview at what we pulled in that pack. 
Let's move on to our four Rebel Clash packs. Two Toxic Croaks, not Toxic Croak. Um, oh, wow, I can't think of his name. Inteleon. And oh, oh my goodness. That it's gonna it's gonna kill me. It evolves from Toxel. Um, oh, please just destroy me in the comments over how I don't know the name of this Pokemon. I should. One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah, energy. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure I did that one correctly. Metal energy, Hatrim, Cursed Shovel, Phalanx, Binacle, Galarian Dardumaka, cute little Vulpix, Milsuri, Galarian Farfetch'd, I have plenty of him from the uh, Galarian Surfetch'd starter deck, theme deck, a Reverse Hollow Duo Blade, and the rare is Arcanine Non-Hollow. Wow, that's a really intense ability. If this has a Burning Scarf attached, it gets 100, plus 100 HP. That's, I mean, that's a V card right there without any drawback, really. I guess you've got to prioritize. I don't, I don't see much downside to that. That's a, that's a good card to run. All right. Toxtricity. It's Toxtricity, that's its name. Wow, I can't believe I couldn't think of it. One, two, three, four. Going with a water energy to start this one. Paulucha. Again, another one from the uh, <laughs> Surfetched deck. Morgrim. Medicham. Meditite. Back to back, just like that. Milsery. Growlithe to go with our Arcanine. Impidimp to go with uh, Morgrim earlier. Bunnelby, Clay of Bunnelby, love the clay artwork. Reverse Hollow of a Grubbin, really nice looking dude. And the rare is Diggersby non Hollow. Doesn't look as OP as the Arcanine does. So I think Arcanine's the uh, favorite here. No, uh, no V's. V Maxes, any, any special things so far in any of these packs. Now we have the V's that were the promos, but those those really don't count. We we know we all know that. One, two, three, four. And up front we have a grass energy. Moving on to Chatot. I, I'm still figuring out my, my setup here. I can't quite get the let me let me tilt the camera a little bit. I kinda like that. The way that I have it set, I'm killing my elbows. This is great content, by the way. Alright. Focusing back on this, Chatot, Chargebug, Skuntank, Dreepy, Snover, really cute Snover, Binacle, Galarian Darnumaka, Vulpix, Reverse Hollow Impidimp, really cool looking at, and, and, we have a Barbacle, Barbaracle, non-hollow, as our rare of that pack. So I'm going to tilt the camera back up because that just did not, uh, I didn't like that. I know it's going to be slightly askew for the rest of the video, but it is going to be okay. Final Rebel Clash pack. Maybe, maybe there are no V's or V Maxes in Rebel Clash. That's why we haven't pulled one. They simply don't exist. And so that's why we got one or we've not gotten any. One, two, three, four. We're going to go with a fire energy, psychic energy, so not fire at all. Carcoal, love my, love Carcoal, I love Colossal. My fav, one of my favorite new Pokemon from Sword and Shield. Beware. Skyla, love Skyla, she's a good one. Roly Coley. Stunky, oh, if we got Roly Coley, Carcoal, and Colossal all in this pack. Clefairy, really cute looking Clefairy. Voltorb. Nosepass. Ooh, Reverse Hollow Flapple, and that is a rare. I think I have Reverse Hollow of Appleton. Uh, so I have a Reverse Hollow of both of these. That's really cool. And our rare in this pack is Seismitoad Non-Hollow. So nothing, nothing at all from these Rebel Clash packs. Not that they are a huge source of things. I've heard that Rebel Clash isn't a great set to go after, but 
it is what it is. Now, I feel really good about both of these Sword and Shield packs. If you didn't watch the booster box opening of Sword and Shield, you should absolutely go do that. Look at how easy that was to open. Oh, that was nice. That was so much fun, opening a booster box. Highly recommend. Really want to do again. But with how much, how pricey they are, it, uh, you know, won't, won't happen every day. Psychic Energy. A Great Ball. A Potion. Ride On. Silly Cobra. Mencino. Vulpix. Muna. Roselia. Reverse Hollow Gengar. That's a rare, a nice rare from this set. And the actual rare is a Hollow Toxicroak. I am fairly certain I don't have that one. And if I do, I'm almost certain I don't have it in Hollow. That is nice. I knew I felt good about this one. So even when it's not V, it's V, uh, hollow at least. You know. And our second, see, look at how easy those are to open. Oh, I love Sword and Shield. I love this set. I really want to get a complete set of it. Within reason. I don't know if I can do all of the, you know, rainbow rares, golden rares, all that stuff. Fighting Energy. Palpad. Citrus Berry. Quillfish, Yamper, Scorapy, Clobopus, Wooloo, Sobble, Reverse Hollow Cloister, and that's a rare. Now, I did just pull a Cloister from the booster box. Uh, I know I did that, and I didn't have one before. But this is still a really nice one. And the rare is Thievil Non-Hollow. I know I have pulled that one before. So, I'm going to be honest. All in all... Little disappointing with this entire box, both of these, but we got two evolutions right here. One with a Raichu in it and one with a Blastoise in it. You know what I mean, and I meant it. We're gonna open a Charizard pack first because this is where we're gonna get our Blastoise, duh. Now this one is only one, two, three to the front because it's evolutions. Starting with a Slowbro Spirit Link. Pokedex, Haunter, I just love evolutions. Oh, this is such an awesome set. Sandshrew, Ponyta, Magnemite, Pikachu, OG Pikachu, Machop. Hey, we've got a Break as our Reverse Hollow, Machamp, and I'm pretty sure I've pulled this one before. If not, then that means I have, well, I see part of the card already. Oh, uh, it's, it's normal. Is it far-fetched? It's, it's far-fetched. You. Why do you do this to me? We're gonna leave Farfetch'd back there. Uh, that's... We got a break from it, at least. We didn't get a break from Farfetch'd. We got a break from the pack. Mm. And our final pack of the day. If break is the best card we've pulled, I'm gonna be a little sad. Not gonna lie. One, two, three... We get another far fetched. In fact, you know what? I bet we get a far fetched. That's how I. That's how I game the system. We got Brock's grit going on right here. Poliwhirl. Mm, these cards are looking a little weird. Magnemite. Magnemite. Maintenance, because I know how to read. Weedle. Tangela. Ponyta. Dodo. Okay, I, it's just me, but I can see a little bit of that card. Either it's not cut right, or it's a good good prize coming. Star you, Reverse Hollow Magnemite. So maybe it was just the Reverse Hollow I was seeing. There's a fold in it. Look at that. Can you see that? There's like a line. I'm trying to hold it right there, right there. There's a line right down the middle of this card. That's weird. And our rare here is Dugong Non-Hollow. Yeah, this card was cut weird. That's weird. I don't know. I don't know about that. Guys, I'm going to be honest. Little bit of a bummer, this entire box. But if you like getting little boxes that you can display stuff in, you can put whatever card you want up here. And if you don't have any sort of sorting options for your cards, these are not terrible, terrible alternatives at all. And so Make sure that you like this video. Make sure you leave a comment telling me which pull was your favorite. If it was far-fetched, you're a liar. And make sure that you follow on the main channel. Subscribe on Twitch. Subscribe on Twitch. 
I guess you could do that. Follow me on Twitter is what I meant to say, at CoachMaxYouTube. And until next time, see you later.